Welcome to Charts from the Media. This is a tutorial demonstrating the convergence pattern in technical analysis. Convergence helps identify changes in trend and potential entry points. It's nice when you actually you spot this pattern because you can use tight stop losses in case the pattern does not play out. We're going to make sense of this chart. Here are the steps to identifying the convergence price pattern. Don't worry, we're going to go back to that chart again and explain things visually. First, look for a lower low on price. Two, oscillators should have higher lows at these same price points. Three, ideally there would be lower volume on the second price low. Four, strong candlestick or bar up on high volume following the low that ideally closes above the previous day's trading range. I know that's a lot, but visually it'll make sense. And last, enter trade after a strong candlestick up on high volume with a stop loss below the recent low. Let's take a look at that chart again. We are looking for a lower low in price. We have that. B is lower than A, but higher lows in RSI and slow stochastics. So here we have higher lows in our oscillators that correspond with prices. Next, we're looking for a strong candlestick up, which is right here, on decent volume. This isn't fantastic volume, but we'll take it. That's decent volume after the lower bottom. So here's that bottom and it's lower than the previous one and then we have that strong candlestick up and then for that candlestick we would like it to close above the previous day's range there is the close and there is a previous day's range so we have what we're looking for there when we have all of these together that's when we're looking for a potential price reversal what you would do is you would enter this day or the next and then you would put your stop loss at that lower low and that's how you have convergence. You'll use convergence when you're looking for a change in trend. Not always does it play out this well, but here's a decent example of it. And you can also use this on the weekly charts. Thanks for watching. Visit chartsfromthemedia.com for definitions, learning tools, videos, and more.